This is an exercise that you effectively will be doing on your own. That is to say that once you get it, you could, this is a choice, you go, this is what he's doing. You could do that, but you're actually gonna disempower someone else's experience. So allow them to get it in their own time. Here is my promise. In the next few minutes, next two, three or four minutes, everyone in this room is gonna know what's going on here. So if in the beginning you go, I have no clue, don't worry, hang in there. Because in a couple of minutes time, you will. And in fact, I'm gonna do it a couple of times. So to begin, I happen to have in my hand a drawing instrument. And so what I plan to do is actually draw the man in the moon. Okay, so immediately, that is a sensitivity for some people. So beware that it's something that you want to actually notice. So I want you to be able to do this for yourself. So it begins. <coughs> The man on the moon has a big face, two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Okay, I'll do it again just to be very sure that you got it, because in a moment I'm gonna ask for volunteers to actually share exactly what I did with the rest of the group. Again, if you know it, great. In a few minutes, everyone's gonna know how to do this. To begin, <clears throat> the man on the moon has a big face, two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. For those particularly who rolled their eyes a moment ago, thought, oh, I know where this is going. Would you like to have a go? and do it in a way that everyone else can see what, so that you, we can actually see and hear you. Who would like to give this a go? Who would like to show how to draw the man in the moon? I will. You've got it. Man, man in the moon has a big face, two eyes, a nose, and a <sighs> Terrific, but not it. Okay. But, sorry, but thank you for playing. Okay, <laughs> that's great. So it takes one person to give it a go. So fantastic, so not quite. Something is not quite right. Uh, sorry, I thought I saw another hand. Who would like to give it a go? If not, would you like me to show it to you again? Yes. Fantastic, okay, because you want to do it exactly the same way, what I am doing. <clears throat> the man on the moon has a big face, two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Who would like to do that? Yes, you got it. Uh, the man on the moon has one eye, two noses, and a huge mouth. No, no, that's okay, <laughs> Beth. <laughs> the man on the moon has a big round face with two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Beautiful, exquisite, exactly as I did it. Sally? The man in the moon has a big face, two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Terrific. Remembering, at this point, if you don't have it, don't worry, in a couple of minutes you will, because shortly I'm going to ask those who have got it to help me provide some clues. <laughs> the man in the moon has two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Beautiful, nicely. Yeah, go ahead. <clears throat> the man of the moon has two eyes and nose and mouth. Okay, anyone else like to have a go? Yes. The man of the moon has a big face, two eyes, a nose and a mouth. Nice, subtle, but nice. Very good, very good. <laughs> I almost missed that myself. Would you like to have another go? Yeah. <clears throat> the man of the moon has a big mouth, two eyes and nose and mouth. Beautiful. <laughs> All right, I'm going to start giving some clues now. So if you're in the world of, I have no clue what's going on, that's okay. That's exactly where you're supposed to be right now. So, for example, <clears throat> man on the moon has a big face, two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Who would like to have a go? Yeah. The man in the moon has a big face, two eyes, a nose and a mouth. Nice. Very good. Yeah, got it. Fantastic. For all, hands up those folks who have got a theory and it's working for you at this stage. Fantastic. Together, on the count of three, <laughs> without giving too much away, but we're going to do it perfectly, we are going to draw together the man in the moon. Are you ready? On the count of three. One, two, three. <clears throat> the man in the moon has two eyes, a nose and a mouth. Okay. <laughs> Who would like to have a go now that perhaps hasn't, until this point, got it? <laughs> if you don't have it, but you, do you have it now? Not yet? That's okay. Hang in there. Another minute, you're going to have it. Um, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, sure. A man in the moon has two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Oh, so close. I don't think. I don't think it was it. I couldn't quite tell, but I don't think so. Yeah. Tim. Uh, the man in the moon has a big face, two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Subtle, but you got it. Yes, fantastic. All right, together, all those that have it, 
You're about a minute away, folks, if you don't. <laughs> On the count of three, and we can make it a lot more obvious now. One, two, three. <coughs> the man in the moon has two eyes, a nose, and a mouth. Okay. <laughs> is anyone unclear as to what the key is? It's okay to say you still haven't got it. I'm just so angry. <laughs> <laughs> No, I've got it now. You've got it now. All right, so let's just be clear. What was the key? <coughs> Clearing the throat. Now, in some cases, it was very subtle. In the beginning, you didn't see or hear it at all. It was always there. Excuse me? I thought it was your arm at first. Yeah. Ah, that's that. yeah. good. So I do ask that question. So what theories were you working with? Because you knew it had less to do with this thing that I was drawing in the air. It had something else to do. Right. What other theories did people have? trying to identify the key. I thought it was the way you crossed your legs. Ah, right, yes, little Indian style thing. But yes, so you, I noticed you've crossed it the same way. Yeah. <laughs> it's great, but for another exercise, it could. Very good, what else? What were the other keys you were trying to unravel? Um, the first two times you did it, you said to begin. Ah. And I was like, ah, and then you didn't do it. Terrific, excellent, <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Sometimes I'll get to the point where it'll be a bit like someone else had done. It was like four eyes, 16 mouths, and you know, it's like, hang on a second, that's nothing like what you first did. Giving a clue that it had nothing to do with that, but it had something to do with something else. Any other, any other theories people had? 